I've been very fortunate to play a wonderful variety of, of magnificent instruments. Grace Cathedral San Francisco, the West Point Cadet Chapel, the Westminster Abbey and St. Paul's Cathedral London, and some in Germany. I think the thing that I look for most from any organ, whether it be pipe or digital, is a warmth of sound and character that you don't just pull out a flute stop and, oh, it's a flute, but has real character and qualities that make it sound beautiful. I've been very pleased with the time that I've spent with the Viscount organ here. And I consider myself something of a purist, but I, I'm enough of a realist having grown up. Uh, my father was a Lutheran pastor. I know that not every church is able to afford what they would like. We can't always have perfection. Uh, we can't always have the ultimate, but we try as best we can. And uh, it's astonishing how technology is making it possible for uh, digital instruments to really recreate effectively the sounds of a pipe organ. When this church, which used to be a Memorial Presbyterian Church, closed, this gorgeous building was sitting here vacant and there is an old pipe organ, and in order to refurbish it and bring it back to life, would have cost more money than the college was able to afford. Who knows, maybe at some point the, the pipes could be resurrected and integrated into the present digital instrument. I feel like the sound is alive, and it's not just what you see is what you get but very uh, musical. I mean, that's really what we expect of any, any instrument that we play, we organists, that it's musical and that it's responsive. And I definitely feel that it is that.